Welcome to MyPatchLink.com's video series on allergic contact dermatitis. In the short video you are about to watch, you will learn about your allergy and where to go for additional information. Hi, my name is Dr. Walt Larson and I'm going to tell you about your patch test results. Your results indicate that you have a contact allergy to eugenol. If you haven't already, I suggest watching the video entitled Allergic Contact Dermatitis. Simply put though, having allergic contact dermatitis means that your immune system has started to react to a particular substance and this may cause your skin to break out whenever it comes into contact with objects that release eugenol. The typical symptoms of the reaction may include severe itching, redness, swelling, flaking, and peeling. Some patients may experience fluid-filled blisters, also called vesicles. What is this substance? Eugenol is found in perfumes, flavorings, oils, antiseptics, and anesthetics. It is also used in formulating insect repellents and biocides, and also in the manufacturing of stabilizers for plastics and rubbers. The smell in a dentist's office is also due to eugenol. So think about products that contain fragrances such as colognes, baby powders, and candles. They may contain eugenol. Additionally, items such as lawn and garden sprays and insect killers and repellents may also contain this substance as well. How do you avoid it? To avoid eugenol, only use products that do not list it on the label or material safety data sheet. Always choose fragrance-free personal care products and cosmetics. Avoid unscented products, since these may contain a masking fragrance related to eugenol. Be sure to tell your health care provider, dentist, veterinarian, and hairdresser that you are allergic to eugenol. Also, if you need to work with a product that contains eugenol, wear protective gloves. Gloves made of natural or synthetic rubber or vinyl are good. Although you have been diagnosed with a contact allergy to eugenol, it is important to remember that it is manageable. Thank you and I wish you success in managing your allergy. As with all medical conditions, if you believe you are suffering from allergic contact dermatitis, please contact your health care provider. Additional resources and information are available to you at mypatchlink.com resources.